injuries are so mysterious and to find like a root cause is so amazing. So listen to this, this is super crazy. Um, you, if you followed my channel for a while, you know I have problems with my Achilles from time to time, left especially, and that's common with basketball players. Um, so, <laughs> if you see that I have the calcinal bone spur, the pump bump, pretty common in basketball athletes, I'd say. Um, and um, there's a lot of causes I've discovered over the years. One of them was how I was going up and down stairs and how I was squatting, P put too much of a load on my Achilles. So I changed that and I have other videos about that. I don't think I have videos about how I go up and down stairs. I should really make that. Um, yeah, I really should. Uh, I need to do that. Okay, so... Um, one thing that I've, I've noticed is my shoes, the left one, always get to being like this. See that? That's interesting. How the left ones have this, get, this, get this bump, but the right ones don't. The right ones stay straight. The left one... Also, this is from... This is directly from... Check this out. My shoe wore through right here. And I have this right here. Right? Crazy, like, what the fuck's going on? Okay, I discovered it. Um, and it's real crazy. I, I chose a day to switch my left and right hands, the way I did things, and I came to put on my shoes, and um, I found that the way that I put on my right shoes was right foot in the back, right hand in the back. Pretty simple, and this, I, I was going right hand in the back for the left also. Just, it works fine but sometimes it doesn't work as well and I get to the point where it's like this and I try to stomp on and that's what causes this which is causing some of this um, so I changed my grip I'm symmetrical now, right? the outside hand's always in the back so now I never miss and it's like the way I've been putting on my shoes for 24 years has been asymmetrical and it's contributed to my Achilles condition so if you think doctors that and physical therapists who see you for short times so you're going to be able to figure this out they're not you're going to have to look at your movements and analyze the hell out of them i think it's crazy it can be anything uh, another example yeah i mean i could i could go into another thing i'm doing right now where my short one shoulder is higher and it's from loading stuff on the, the right side of my backpack and always drinking from from water like this so just now I've been doing this and with the left when I'm doing this investigating this area because that's where I feel the stretch super super tight tissue so now I'm massaging that opening up my whole body just by by analyzing asymmetries and movements so highly recommend y'all get to work on that let me know in the comments what you think of this I don't expect a million views on this video but I expect this to be I don't know I think it's it's really cool idea and I, I, I would love to know your thoughts so I'll get back to you in the comments as well so much love from energy efficient best energy efficient basketball peace